Hold number seven. People who use Grubhub usually tip more than people who use DoorDash. I don't know why. It's comics and shots. A completely improvised, semi-comedic musing. Seriously, they're the exact same freaking service. Tip on either one, jerks. By Howard Stern's Mick the Nerd, a.k.a. YouTube and TikTok's Mick the Maverick, a.k.a. Mick the Man, a.k.a. a guy who doesn't get it with the tipping. It's so weird. Today's subject, Axe Cop. Remember that old chestnut? Am I using that right? Old 2010s era webcomic. Drawn by a 30-year-old, written by his, like, 8-year-old brother. It was great. At the scene of the fire, the cop found the perfect axe. And then, from this day forward, I am Axe Cop. And it had, like, an animated series where Nick Offerman played... Axe Cop, it was really fun. Yeah. Ended in 2017, but it's classic. Yeah. The website's still up there. Where you can read all the comic without having to sign up for a Patreon. Unlike some webcomic creators, you know who you are. I'm not even going to name names, but it's really annoying. You can't just have something be for free forever for a long ass time and then say, yeah, now you gotta pay for it. That annoys people. That annoys people. Paying is optional, okay? <sighs> you know, like, webcomics today, it's all different now. Barely anyone has their own website these days. Like, uh, most of them are just using webtoons or tapas. Tapas. Yeah. And those that do have their own website still use tapas and webtoons to advertise the comics more. It's weird because, like, you know, they put some, like, like that uh, Beelzebub family, I think, Beelzebub, Death Metal Family. No, no, not Death Metal Family, that's a Russian cartoon. Uh, it's this family about of satanic, like, death metal people. Yeah. Some of the stuff on the webtoons is not on their Tumblr page where they originally posed the comics. Yeah. yeah. But Axe Cop, man. <laughs> Didn't they make a card game for that, too? Oh, what did they make a card game for? I just love how, like, people just kept getting and losing superpowers randomly. <laughs> Splash some lobster blood on you and you get lobster powers. Have a, you get a bite of lemon... You become Axe ax Cop with Lemon. <laughs> I think one of the Castlevania games had a similar premise with blood getting on you. A joke made fun of in Manly Guys Doing Manly Things, aka the punchline is Machismo. That's a comic that went into, like, frickin', you know, obscurity, didn't it? Huh. <sighs> and. Huh. <sighs> Basically, this has just been an old man of ripe, ancient age of 33, looking back on memories of webcomics past. <sighs> it's okay to live in the past sometimes, but no, you can't stay there. No, you can't stay there. With that, like, comment, and subscribe. Donate if you're feeling nice. Share it with the bear. And always remember, praise be to the blood elk and fear the stapopotamus. And death to Kronos. <laughs> I'm honestly considering moving to Europe, considering that servers there get paid a living wage. Seriously. <laughs>